you are now using SAP Fury and you would like to add an additional application to the Fury Launchpad. The first thing you need to do is to click on the profile icon here and go to application finder. Then look for the application you want. So for example, if I'm looking for an application for sales orders, I can type sales order and then click on search. SAP will show all the applications or all the tiles that have the word sales order in them. So for example, create outbound deliveries for sales orders, my sales order, and so on. Now let's say I'm looking for another application, for example, costing. I get the result, no apps to display. Although I am pretty sure there are applications with the word costing in them. But now I don't have any. This means that my user is not authorized to use these applications. So how can we add an authorization to our user ID to use the costing applications? The first thing you need to do is to go to the SAP Fury Applications Library. I will leave you a link in the description. This is a public library from SAP for all the applications that are available in SAP Fury. So this is where you go to check if a certain application exists and what is the name of the application. Now I'm working on SAP S4HANA, so I will use SAP Fury apps for SAP S4HANA. And then here you can filter with many things, line of business, rules, industries. I will just click on all apps and then I will use the search box. So I'm looking for the applications with the word costing. And I'm actually looking for this application, Manage Costing Runs. So click here. And here we have all the details related to the application. For example, what is the application used for? So if you go to Product Features, this application is used for this. What are the key features? If there are any notes. And then if you go to the implementation information, this has all the, de the technical details needed to be able to install and use this application in SAP Fury. And if we go to Configuration, and go down you will find the business rules and this is the business rule you need to add to the user id in sap to be able to use this application so i will copy this rule and then i will switch to sap GUI and go to transaction su01 insert the user id click on change go to rules and paste the rule we copied from the application library and then enter and click on save. Now this application or this rule has been assigned to my user starting from today. And from now I should have access to the applications that are assigned to this rule. So if I go back to SAP Fury, I will be able to use this application. The transaction to use SAP